Hello, this is Alex from Trainer Day. Here I'm going to show you our new training plans feature. You can call it it's plans beta in the menu here, but it's going to be called training plans. Anyway, um, now I'm on what's called featured authors and plans. So we've got featured authors and plans. We've got plan search and my plans. My plans is where you kind of create and manage your own plans. Anyway, so, so I came to Featured Authors and Plans. Here's an example of a typical race block, a build, a base, a build, a peak, and a race, and it's just kind of explaining that and what it means. Um, then there's a button to click to view your featured authors because that's what we were coming for here. We're also going to have very soon a block recommendation tool, so you don't want a base, a build, a peak and race you want to do, you're not looking to race, then you might want a different set of blocks. Anyway, here's some featured authors. Um, this is just a prototype at the moment. It's not actually real, but um, you can come in here and you can say, oh, okay, Spartan blocks. That sounds good. Okay, so I'm going to click on Spartan base. Okay, so this has taken me to plan search here. I could search by different types. It's By default, it's going to show you the plans that I just clicked on. So I clicked on Spartan base. Right now, this is just an example. But as you can see, the, the good thing about in search here is it shows you the dynamics of the plan, meaning that 17% of them are threshold, 29% are endurance, 4% are tempo, and 50% are recovery. And you can see the counts also, 12 workouts are recovery. Anyway, this is a very easy plan. It's 12 weeks, but it's only one hour a week. So it's, it's very let's say non, it requires minimum commitment um, and it's got the stress from 18 to 39 per week. It is a base workout. So let's go ahead and click on view plan. Now it tells me the purpose of this is, you know, for the absolute minimalist in mind with a safety first approach. So it's, you can see it starts really easy, gets harder. Anyway, and then if I say, oh, I really like this plan. So I'm going to go ahead and copy that to my plan. So it creates a clone of this or a copy of this. And then I can edit it and do what I want. So I click copy, copy. It's Spartan base copy. I'm just going to call it Spartan blade, my Spartan base. Alex's Spartan base, although Alex was the original person. You can change the description if you want. And the interesting thing is you can change the days. So it was created as a, a Wednesday, Sunday workout, but I know that I'm really busy and I am I can only do it on weekends, so I'm going to take it as a Saturday, Sunday. Okay, save it. Now it moved all the workouts automatically to Saturday and Sunday, and so that's a very unique feature, I think. Um, and I can edit this plan. So if I click on, you know, I don't actually have any workouts at the moment if I add workouts. So... Uh, if I, let's open this in a new tab, let's just find a workout. Let's just say I like that workout. I came to workout search. I added it to my workouts and now I come back here and I refresh the page and now I have that workout there. And so now I could just add that one and say, oh, I want to work out on this day also. So obviously with a bunch of 21 minute workouts and then I throw in a 90 at the beginning, that doesn't make any sense, but <laughs> let's just put it at the very end when I'm starting to feel very strong, right? And if you want to delete a workout, you can just grab it and throw it over here and delete it and it's gone. So one other thing that you can do here is you can uh, come and click on a specific workout. So we could click on this one, let's say. Uh, this one's called 4560. We could edit the name. We could change the description to be whatever you want. Now, this description and this name would then be unique for this particular day. If you want to edit the base workout, you could either click here. That will take you to the to this page, and you can then go to the editor page under the more options. Or you also have a link here that you can actually go to. Okay, so... That's how it works, or that's how the, the modifying the plan works. Um, you're not able to turn this public because you cloned it from someone else. We don't want everybody creating a bunch of copies and then having a whole bunch of duplicate, let's say, workouts or a duplicate plans. Um, you can create a new plan here 
if you want. But you can. The interesting thing is, is you can download this. And so you download it. You set a start week. So let's just say I want to set start next week. You can pick any day of that week, and you click download. Now, as of next week, by the time anybody's using this, you'll be able to set what type of download you want. So this is going to download all your MRC files in this particular example. But you'll be able to say ZWO files or your ERG files. So I click download. I get this zip file, which I can open, and it gives me all of those workouts, and it tells me the days, so week one, day seven, six, week one, day seven, week one, day six, seven, you can see all the different, you know, this, these are all, let's say, Saturday and Sunday, and all the different workouts, and then I can take them into my favorite program, whatever I'm using, uh, whether it be Golden Cheetah, or Trainer Road, or you know, or whatever program I want to load it into. The other interesting thing is, is it does come with this this spreadsheet that you can open up and just have a review of the entire plan. So you can see the stress, you can see everything, you can see, you know, all the different details, and you can get the link. You can just copy a link out of there and paste it up here, and you can look at it. Now, the one cool thing about this download is you can actually just then take it and import it directly into um, Google Calendar. And you can have the link in the calendar so you can see it. So that's like a free way to have a training plan, right? Right Between using Trainer Row, uh, Trainering Peaks, uh, sorry, <laughs> Trainer Day. I don't know the name of this company. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope we're able to provide you some great training plans, some great training, and thanks from Trainer Day.